Hi everyone, this is part of our secret section on August 24th. Well, we just had this earthquake that happened up in the Napa Valley area up in San Francisco. And if you'd watched the other video, we had shown that this was a precursor to the end of days coming. Another sign that the harp machine was used and we're nearing the end of days when the great earthquake and the nuclear war begins through there. Well, at the same time, on the night before this, on August 23rd, they had the brand new Doctor Who, and he has had his face changed. He's gotten his new body, and he's showing up through his police box right here. Well, they had another show come on right after this that was called The Intruders right here, and this one showed a lot of the same things that I've shown on these glyphs as well as in the Bible about this new host. See this right here? In this new show they are giving out this new type of host Eucharist like the Catholic Eucharist and it has something in it just like this guy right here. You see him coming down and actually going into this Sphinx going right through this open door. See there with the key and now these people are being possessed right here. Now the people are being possessed by this host Eucharist exactly as we keep showing that the Bible says is coming with this new world order. See that right there? See the two halves blended together? So you can see it right there. Well let's take a look at this trailer here and we will show some of those same things. Notice that they are using a host Eucharist just as here in the book of Daniel, Daniel 8 the individual known as the little horn that many people call an antichrist and it waxed great even to the host of heaven and it cast down some of the host of the stars to the ground and stamped upon them all right here and you can see that right here Daniel 8:12, and an host was given him against the daily sacrifice the daily sacrifice is the breaking of bread of Jesus Christ and this is when the Vatican falls and they take away the host Eucharist just as if you're at home and you break bread in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ this all actually symbolizes the Passover cedar which was the last supper that Jesus did where you actually have a it's an actual feast that you do before the Passover even the drinking of the wine and the breaking of the bread is all in that feast called the Passover cedar well we had this earthquake that happened right here see right here we just went over this in Napa you see how they made sure at the time was 320 44 in the beginning they had said it was at 330 which would be 33 for Jesus Christ now 320 and we have the 44 for Obama the 44th president what is Revelation 320 Revelation 320 this is a warning to all of us behold I stand at the door and knock. If any man hear my voice and open the door, I will come into him and will sup with him and he with me. It, we're nearing the time of Jesus Christ right here. Now in the book of Daniel, well in the book of Revelation it says that Jesus Christ will come with the voice of an archangel. And then you have Michael's deliverance. This is why you have all the things with Michael Brown in the news in Ferguson. The same as here in this earthquake the governor or the mayor of this one Napa Napa area is named Mike. We're seeing this name Mike all around us. The time of when Michael the Archangel stands up with his sword to bring vengeance and justice and judgment all upon the earth. Right there. When he stands up there shall be a time of trouble such as never was since there was a nation. This will be the greatest tribulation and horrible time in all of history coming upon the earth. May God have mercy on us all. You know, it's just right in front of us. So let's take a look at this trailer right here and let's concentrate on this. Let's show that at the same time that they're doing this earthquake, now we have on the BBC channel, see the BBC? A B means a two, a two and a three. This is the Freemasons and Illuminati 322 made backwards. This is their channel from the skull and bones.
see here most of the top presidents and things and most of the world guys in charge right here the skull and bones society this represents the beast from the bottomless pit that will raise up for the V the fifth age coming as we show all the time and they have this number 322 which backwards will be 223 which is for the BBC right there see BBC is run by these Illuminati Freemasons and such setting up for the next age so let's take a look at this trailer real quick through here and watch how they're talking about the new host welcome back you've been missed this book begins at the point you began before in another life Tonight, as I speak to you of them, I fear no one. Because this life is ours. It is not theirs. We're just here to shepherd you. You've not been yourself. Sorry, honey. I guess the music just took me away. <laughs> Amy, you'll see that some of them fight it. Sometimes it takes years when the older one doesn't want to give up. If people knew, it would all fall apart. People like us have a responsibility, don't we? Where can we talk? Here is good. No, it's not. It's sweet. You we'll keep a secret? Amy, where are you? Amy's all right. In the beginning, there was death. We do die, but we can return. Who are you? Who's your wife? I'm just trying to tell you the truth. The few, the very few, those who possess the will and strength of purpose. Welcome back, Reverti. Welcome back. Again. Madison! What goes around comes around. Well, you can see they showed this host Eucharist right here, right in that movie, or in that TV series coming. Just as with this great, or that earthquake that was all a sign to all of us that we're nearing the end through there. See this movie here? This came out earlier called The Host. And those, these things would enter into the human body and then basically take over. They did the same things with the eyes. This has been shown to us too much for it to be fake. It's in the Bible to happen, Daniel 8, and an host was given him against the daily sacrifice. They take away this Catholic Eucharist. The Russian Orthodox Church is all prepared to rise up after the Vatican gets hit. The USA and the Vatican will get hit, and then the grievous head wound is healed, and the Russian Orthodox Church is prepared by the Jesuits to rise up with their new host Eucharist. See it right there? When he comes down, just like the brand new Doctor Who coming, and nobody knows who he is, whoever he goes into. Just like right here. We had the new Doctor Who, then we had, at the same time, we had the brand new Intruders movie coming, showing the new host Eucharist coming. Right here. 320. May God have mercy on us all. Revelation 3.20 Jesus is at the door. Confess with your mouth, the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart, God hath risen him from the dead, and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. May God have mercy on us all. In the late 20th century, hostile forces inside the United States grow strong. The city of Los Angeles is ravaged by crime and immorality. 
to protect and defend its citizens, the United States Police Force is formed. A presidential candidate predicts a millennium earthquake will destroy L.A. in divine retribution. Like the mighty fist of God, Armageddon will descend upon the city of Los Angeles, the city of Sin, the city of Gomorrah, the city of Sodom, and waters will arise and separate this sinful, sinful city from our country. An earthquake measuring 9.6 on the Richter scale hits at 12.59 p.m. August 23rd in the year 2000. Constitution is amended and the newly elected president accepts a lifetime term of office. The country's capital is relocated from Washington, D.C. to the president's hometown of Lynchburg, Virginia. Los Angeles Island is declared no longer part of the United States and becomes the deportation point for all people found undesirable or unfit to live in the new moral America. The United States police force, like an army, is encamped along the shoreline making any escape from L.A. impossible. From the southeastern hills of Orange County to the northwestern shore of Malibu, the Great Wall excludes L.A. from the mainland. The president's first act as permanent commander-in-chief is Directive 17. Once an American loses his or her citizenship, they are deported to this island of the damned, and they never come back.